Hello there, viewer, and welcome to another SOS reading. I hope you're doing okay out there, viewer. So, viewer, let's go ahead and find out what you need to know right now about your current situation, okay, for the viewer here. Yeah, you guys are waking up to a new life. So no matter what the circumstances are, what's going on, just know that there is a new day dawning for you. So yes, new life, new beginning. Get excited about something new in your life. And I feel a lot of you viewers um, have some, you know, really have uh, positive ex expectations of receiving exactly what you guys need, okay? Um, you know, she's uh, stretching, like waking up here. So I feel a lot of you viewers are waking up to a new self here, okay? So be gentle with yourself. Honor, honor some new things that are entering into your life. What else for the viewer? So this is good, viewer. What else for the viewer? Look for a sign. Okay. Pay attention. Be in a state of observation right now. I feel a lot of you viewers are starting to pick up or see signs. Um, you may be like seeing things that are coincidental, right? Well, we know that's not, uh, there ain't no coincidences here. The universe is speaking to you, your angel, your God, Jesus, you know, your guides here. They're showing you signs here. So be aware, okay? Um, you guys are being shown something when it comes to new life, new lifestyle, a new beginning here. So I would be, uh, you know, getting excited here, viewer. What else for the viewer? I'm also seeing, <laughs> I'm seeing you being on this pedestal as well. So um, I feel that there's some type of up leveling, an advancement here, um, feeling, um, you know, a sense of higher levels of awareness and consciousness. Okay. So, yes, viewer, congratulations for making it uh, thus far. Just expect the best for yourself from this point um, forward, okay? I know some of you viewers are going through a lot of significant changes. Look at this. We were just talking about, you know, coincidences and we've got serendipity. Viewer, you guys are receiving, um, you guys are really receiving some type of leg up, spiritual support, physical support, um, you know, the forces of nature and uh, the higher forces are working with you. So something is being created in your life. I feel a lot of you viewers may even find yourself, um, you know, just kind of having things go your way. And it's, it's just leading you to higher levels of experience, of joy, of delight. I'm seeing something about fortune here for a lot of you viewers. Okay, so my goodness, look for a sign, viewer. This isn't a joke. Maybe some of you guys, there might be something significant here with a four-leaf clover. Okay, let's see. What else for the viewer? So, viewer, this is a general reading. However, it is someone's oracle messages. So, either it'll re resonate for the most part or it won't. Uh, so if you find that the messages don't resonate for you, then just either click off or you can check out past messages as well by going to the playlist tab. Those are all timeless. Okay. There's going to be people. Okay. You're, you're receiving a leg up in the spiritual realm and the physical realm here. People are going to be uh, drawn to you. So accept help. Okay. They are going to move you forward or at least support you in this new sense of, you know, the new you, new lifestyle, new beginning here. Okay. I feel a lot of you viewers um, have been doing some uh, prayer work, affirmations, holding your, you know, holding faith and it is working. Okay. So expect some type of a miracle as well. What else for the viewer? Meditation brings answer answers. So viewer, you are receiving signs here. Um, pay, pay attention to uh, these times that you need to maybe rest, close your eyes, 
uh, take time to meditate, um, you know, do whatever you guys can do to quiet the mind so you can really hear and seek answers from within and from the universe, especially when you guys have questions about your path right now. Because there may be a sense of, for some of you viewers, feeling at a crossroads right now or unsure of which way to go, right? Or we're just waiting patiently for the next step here. So just have a little bit more patience, okay? Um, I feel a lot of you viewers don't need to worry too when it comes to some type of new phase in your life. You know, just kind of follow others if you need to, okay? And then you're going to figure things out on your own and feel a lot more confident about where you're at. Let's see, what else for the viewer? Something is going to bring you guys a real peace here. So I'm seeing a significant thing of making amends and a peace from the past and coming into a place of peace. So just be at peace with yourself no matter what's going on. Spirit is um, helping you guys see these signs um, and these things that, you know, again, synchronicities, these, these things that just happen to happen, you know, ha that's funny, happen to happen. <laughs> um, so to bring you guys peace here. So viewer, do whatever you guys can do right now. Meditation for peace, cultivate peace. And also trust that there's some type of delivery or news or information or something is going to happen here for a lot of you viewers where we just have this overwhelming sense of peace that has just really um, been summoned here because you've been cultivating it, okay? Let's see, what else for the viewer? You are co-creating big time with spirit here. Viewer, ooh, we've got some like magician energy as well. Pay attention to um, things that you guys are feeling inspired to take action on as well. Uh, we've got this yang energy at play here. So yeah, be willing to co-create with spirit. Spirit is gifting you guys some type of new life. I mean, look at this, some type of new beginning, uh, possibly someone in your life as well. Okay. But most importantly, this is about you guys. I mean, look at this little divine's hand right now. The divine's hand is working with you. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Ah, viewer. This is a time to really stay focused on the good things in your life. Stay focused on looking for a sign, uh, but also being in this moment of joy or just trying to be at peace at with whatever's going on at the moment. Okay. Um, what else for the viewer? Yeah, more about mending, healing, something from the past here is healing, viewer, okay? So something really is coming together for, um, for you, viewer. Now, if some of you viewers have had some rifts and problems in friendships or connections in the past or maybe a certain one, or maybe there was something, um, you know, from earlier days um, in your life, just know... There's some type of completion and healing happening here and something is being transformed and like recreated uh, from some past um, wounds, okay? And turning into something beautiful here. So I feel a lot of you um, viewers are being brought together with the right uh, people here that can help support you, okay? And especially when it comes to, um, you know, serving a higher purpose, um, and, uh, being aligned with these things that you're feeling, um, drawn to. Okay. Cause you definitely have this deep knowing that something strong is happening when it comes to, uh, new changes in your life. What else for the viewer? Okay. <laughs> viewer something and someone is coming together. Oh my goodness. I was just seeing these two being really drawn together here. So yeah, for a lot of you viewers, whatever has gone on to matters of the heart here, something is going to uh, be very peaceful. Something is going to mend your heart if you're feeling, you know, that it's still taking some time. Uh, but trust that there is a loyal heart here for, uh, for you viewers. So I don't know what's going on in your love situation or matters of the heart or things that are very um, significant and important to you. 
uh, but trust that there is some type of loyalty here, some type of commitment, okay? I'm seeing a king and a queen here as well. We've got this king and queen owl here, so there may be something uh, strong with uh, telepathy um, and a very spiritual connection. What else for the viewer? Yeah, viewer, and I was getting for a lot of you guys, someone being brought to your life here to bring some type of new life too. And look, we got this loyal heart. Building blocks. Something is being established right now. So stay, look at this person. They're in a state of observation, choosing and deciding what they want to take, right? So maybe what you need to do right now, viewer, is you're looking for a sign, right? And uh, make, the, make these decisions, um, you know, based on whether it's going to help build you up or is it going to take you down, right? Because that can help some of you viewers figure out what's going on when it comes to deciding what's good and right for you. But for a lot of you viewers, there's something about you really materializing some type of dream of yours. Um, and for a lot of you viewers, a very strong thing about your purpose or you know, doing something very significant that helps you feel very secure and independent with yourself, okay? Others are coming. I just can't help but see this person is looking out. This is you, viewer, and having the right energies, the right people, the right things to establish some type of strong foundation because I do feel a lot of you viewer, viewers have gone through some type of chaos or changes and challenges, right? Things, maybe things have had to break down in order to be rebuilt here in a strong and sturdy way. What else for the viewer? Treasure Island. Viewer, I really get this thing about, um, I'm like getting three of wands energy with you. So not only are we expanding, but there's something about you guys really receiving some type of results or um, resources or people here to really show you, um, yes, that you've been putting the work and the effort in and you do deserve these things. Uh, some of you, you may feel like you've been on a long journey and there's some, some type of true discovery of some type of treasure here. Um, there could be something significant with a home or home life um, and feeling at home with oneself. So a lot of you viewers really are this like treasure. You're just a soul that has a treasure, okay? Um, and Spirit wants you guys to feel this sense of preciousness that is going on with you. I don't even know if that's a word, but that's what I get. It's just that this, this is, you know, you're precious here to Spirit. So Spirit wants to carry you guys in honor take you to a place where you guys are going to be honored as well. But there is um, a big thing of uh, fortune <laughs> I'm getting for a lot of you viewers. So you're heading in the right direction, viewers. So keep looking forward to the future. I, I feel this is a time to just kind of take it easy, pace yourself um, again with the building blocks. Decide what is going to work for you and help you guys build. If it doesn't feel like it's going to be sturdy or strong, in your life right now, then you need to, you know, think about that, right? And figure out what it is that you want to put in place there. What else for the viewer? Also getting earth sign coming through, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Some of you guys will be brought uh, people here that will help you in your love life by the book. This is a time to just kind of follow the rules too. So I would say for a lot of you viewers, don't do anything too risky. We are establishing and recovering for some of you guys or rebuilding here, um, something solid. So trust that you are advancing, but you don't have to figure everything out on your own. I mean, we do have this helpful people here. So maybe some of you guys do some research, learn, grow, but don't do anything like off the path right now. Okay. Right now, it's just like follow the lead. You don't have to reinvent the wheel. Just keep moving forward. Um, and be on the lookout again for information, people, uh, things that um, are being gifted to you to help you guys create some type of beautiful foundation for yourself or to establish yourself or to create some type of dream life here, okay? I am getting justice, Car. I'm getting justice energy too, so... 
A lot of you viewers are um, correcting some balance here by keep continuing to move forward. So you do want to keep moving forward into a new sense of, you know, experience, new life here. Things are going to go your way, viewer, okay? Something has happened in the past, but there is a sense of things being handled <laughs> in a fair way for you, okay? And you just need to trust this. This is going to be a universal balance and alignment. What else for the viewer? Yeah, I just said, I was saying this earlier, viewers, be in a state of observation. I mean, look at her and here. We're just in a state of observation. Spirit is showing you guys signs. There's no joke about this, about helpful people. Um, also, some of you, you're asking questions about people or a person, and Spirit is gifting you guys answers about that. Uh, but, you know, just be in a state of observation. You don't need to rush anything either, viewer. That's the other thing I'm getting is we're not rushing anything, okay? Uh, but pay attention so that you are aware of opportunities, that you're aware of what's going on as well, especially when it comes to um, things that are coming into focus. Because I feel a lot of you, it's either you're going somewhere or some, or there's like energies coming towards you. There's just this new life here. And so Spirit wants you to be uh, aware for when these, uh, for when the time arises, you know, to take on these opportunities or to take action. What else for the viewer? Yep, I was talking about recovery here too. So viewer, for some of you viewers, if you guys have been battling anything um, physically or with your health, you know, that kind of stuff, you are recovering. And also, I can see a big thing um, happening with recovering in a relationship here for some of you guys too, okay? Uh, but, but viewer, let's not get hung up on the past here, okay? Because whatever it is, you're recovering from the past, but be willing to, you know, look for these signs that are pushing you guys towards a new. A lot of you viewers are coming into a new connection here. But it is, it, it is going to be a very strong, to, uh, a strong connection, okay? Yes, you guys are recovering, okay? So take time. What else? You can't rush recovering. No place like home. Oh my goodness. Viewer, you guys are, okay. Oh, there's really, okay. You really are getting into a place where, yes, there something is wrapped around home life too. For some of you guys, you're getting a new home because I can see this thing about you guys going the distance, achieving some type of goal, um, creating some type of dream life or home life here. Um, but no matter what, Spirit wants you guys to feel very comfortable with no, with what's going on right now, no matter what, and to feel very safe and secure, okay? And yes, you guys are being shown the way here, looking for the sign. I mean, look at this sea turtle is going towards no place like home. So you're being shown a place that you're, you're being shown uh, a situation where you're going to feel very protected, safe, and secure here, okay? a loyal heart this right here is a very peaceful situation now isn't it viewer look at that peace no light no 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 place like home loyal heart what else for the viewer Viewer, you are recovering. Now we have the devil card here. So Capricorn energy is coming through. Some of you viewers may be really obsessed right now about a situation. So pay attention to that. I would say also pay attention to, um, you know, things that you feel uh, that could be tying you down. Or maybe, you know, for some of you guys, you're, you're being shown signs, <laughs> you know, that are, that are cautioning you as well. And someone here. Um, I want a little bit more, though, with this uh, devil energy uh, for you, viewer. Let's get a little bit more about this devil energy for the viewer. Maybe 
want the viewer to know. Oh, that one, those just fell just down like that. Oh my goodness. Okay. So I feel a lot of you viewers, I'm going to get one more too. A lot of you viewers don't need to obsess. I feel that you have been obsessing here. Yes, there has been a lot of chaos and conflict. It's all coming into order here. So Spirit says, Spirit says, don't get too obsessed about a situation or overthink things. Okay. Don't hang on to things either. If things are um, falling away or letting go, it's because we're establishing something solid here, okay? For recovery, right? For, you know, bringing in a situation that is peaceful and good for you. So some of you may need to be aware of someone too. We, we do, I'm like getting something about, not all of you, it could be, it could, could be a man or a woman, but there is a strong feminine that that's coming in here. Um, you know, that could be like a snake-like energy here. So just pay attention to that, right? Uh, don't give in to situations that could make matters worse. Um, whatever con conflict or chaos that's going here, just do things by the book here. Um, and also, you know, viewer, I was getting this thing about justice here. So, you know, as long as you're making good decisions, <laughs> right, that are... Um, best and noble for you and others involved you have nothing to worry about because spirit is saying you guys are going through a situation right now um, to really rid anything that could be even potentially negative or toxic for you so allow these changes uh, to happen here okay because it's putting things into order and spirit is showing me with that double card that you guys are going to get blessed here okay with the right energy and the right energies. I mean, we have yang, and so now we've got the yin and the yang. And what did we have? Blessed. What do we have? Loyal heart here. So, ooh, viewer, some something is being created for your life, and spirit doesn't want you guys to get caught up in anything that makes you feel hooked, or um, especially pay attention to anything or anyone that you're having a hard time letting go of, even though deep down inside you know better, okay? Because the signs are showing you guys uh, that there is something much better for you, okay? So you're receiving exactly what you guys need to even create some type of new life, new situation, and to keep ascending. I mean, we got this yin-yang here. It's complete balance here. No wonder, no place like home, okay? It's the right situation. It's a blessed situation. My goodness, viewer, please look for the signs. Let's see, what else for the viewer? Oh my goodness, viewer, this is a strong soulmate reading here. So, uh, okay, so for you viewers that aren't looking for a soulmate or a love situation, then you need to replace this with um, a, a higher calling, your purpose, and feeling really um, very blessed and peaceful with your own self and what's going on here. Um, but a lot of you, and I'm going to just continue to, to talk in this reading about a soulmate here because it's coming through very strong. Um, we have the loyal heart. Okay. And I was picking up this thing about you guys connecting with another here. And now we've got soulmates and it's the key to your heart here. So there's something very strong with you guys coming into a, a right soulmate or soulmates situation, right? The people that can help and support you. So don't be afraid of what's being, for some of you guys, let go of, or maybe even for some being shown to you that is causing some chaos and conflict, right? Because I can see like a Tasmanian devil energy here just stirring up a lot of things. But stay peaceful and stay calm because this is actually clearing the air for you. This is like divine intervention. So whatever chaos and conflict has happened, it's it's a sense of purification and it's the process that has to happen, okay, in order for the right alignment, the right uh, connections. Hmm. What else for the viewer? Improving health. See, viewer, right now I would say concentrate on doing things that help you guys improve your health, that make you feel good inside and out, okay, because this is your new life is focusing on, you know, yourself, 
making yourself a priority because maybe for some of you viewers you know you were always doing for others or we just had our focus on the wrong uh, you know the wrong things and maybe we depleted our energy because yeah i mean look we got the devil card there so we're focused on things that are taking away from our energy okay and spirit is showing you don't give in to this okay don't give in to things that take away your energy give in to what gives you energy improve your own health right now because it's only bringing you guys into a very good situation a very blessed situation what else for the viewer viewer something strong with you really understanding your purpose and understanding and getting the answers that you are asking right we're asking a big why here and for some there may be something here with meditation brings answers going back to to why you love some you know love to do something or um yeah for some of you there could be something here with getting things stirred up again getting inspired again uh, getting curious again Let's get a little bit more with this why, because I feel a lot of you uh, viewers, it's like you just have to ask and spirit is going to gift you guys the information. There could be a book or knowledge headed your way as well, viewer, that's going to be very valuable for you. And I would say that it's going to be mostly, um, you know, significant to uh, about life and what you need to know. OK, let's get a little bit more about this why. I think it's always important to do um, inventory with oneself every once in a once in a while and to ask ourselves why are we doing things or why are we you know because those are important it helps uh, ref helps us focus it helps us make new decisions or help helps us uh, direct things in, in in the right way okay why oh you guys are ready for something okay yes you're ready for a whole new phase spirit wants you guys to get really curious so extend your light um, light-hearted energy to others and also the other thing that's happening to a lot of you viewers is you're getting um, okay your abilities as far as uh, your sensitivities to um, you know connecting to your higher self or the other side here um, is getting uh, is enhancing and is changing so be open to new experiences when it comes to getting information especially when you've asked okay um, and spirit wants you to not be afraid to pick things up that you feel inspired to or to take action that you're feeling inspired to because that's also going to help you guys uh, and guide you uh, to get answers that you are seeking as well um, and there may be something here where someone may be very curious about you too so um, I'm just getting this thing about like why not why not flirt <laughs> why not go extend your light-hearted energy to others this is your time to uh, be light-hearted to have a, a sense of innocence okay I'm getting like you know what else I'm getting with this why card is a judgment actually viewer so I feel this like great awakening is definitely happening here um, with you and really figuring out and tuning in and focusing more about your higher calling okay not just about love but something about your higher calling your purpose what else for the viewer be flexible oh my gosh i wanted to say something um, about you know staying adaptable at this time i mean we do have that chaos and conflict so yeah it's not going to go all you know it's not going to go as planned and that's okay because i feel for some of you if you just know that to you know you know make your plans and decisions but sometimes it's just not going to go that way and the more that you're aware of it you know the less it has a hold on you so yeah the more you guys are flexible actually too about situations and the twists and turns of things and maybe things just not going in your favor even at that right that's going to help you stay very peaceful okay and it's only going to help you guys stay very aligned with what's really true for you so this is a temporary situation viewers so don't feel like you're you know you're going to have to be like trying to balance all the time because that could get very exhausting because remember where we're headed is no place like home because you deserve it 
What else for the viewer? Regeneration. Um, oh my gosh. And look, to be fair, see, I even said this something like, you know, I was getting that justice card earlier here. So this is just more confirmation. So something is going to be gifted to you guys to make things fair. So I would say a lot of you viewers had felt some type of injustice in a situation with someone or people. You're going, you've gone through these changes here to make things balanced and fair karmically here. Okay. So to be fair, honor what's happening here, honor these changes because you're going to be gifted a blessing and blessings in your life. Okay. Just keep looking for these signs that are showing you towards this new life, the, this new connection, the helpful people. So take time and, um, you know, we have this thing about improving your health and we have this uh, card of regeneration. Um, viewer, remember I was talking about um, divine intervention, things being purified. If things have gone crazy or chaotic or change, it's because a great purification has had to happen here but you are regenerating viewer and there's something like strong and super almost supernatural happening with you and you need to just stay strong okay because you have the ability to regenerate here look we're establishing something solid it's like you're going to be stronger um than ever before what else for the viewer Yeah, viewer, you're done. Viewer, you are done. Okay, more confirmation about to be fair, like this justice kind of card going on. We're, you know, cause and effect here. <laughs> karma. Here's karma round and around, right? And this is why spirit has brought the winds of change, a change in the wind. Okay, so it may on the surface feel very awful or feel uncomfortable or feel just, ugh, you know, it's not so fun, but there is a reason why. There's been some, spirit does not want you to be stagnant viewer. And so in order for, in order for, you know, a soul not to be stagnant, especially a soul that has great blessings, <laughs> spirit will do things here, okay? Things are going to happen. But it's all, it's all benefiting you here because we don't want to go into vicious cycles and patterns round and around and around over. Like, you know, it's like the same experiences, maybe different people, whatever it is. You know, it's just like the same situation, <laughs> different face, different place, whatever, round and around. So yes, a change in the wind. And this is exactly what we need. And it's a good thing, viewer. You, you really are experiencing some uh, profound changes here, but it is bringing you profound blessings, okay? What else for the viewer? Chop wood. Okay, I'm just getting so much. It's about, you know, just kind of do... Just do things by the book right now. Stay focused. I was getting something about, you know, uh, pacing yourself. It's like just, you know, do what you guys got to do, right? Don't get don't get too overly concerned about, attack, you know, maybe things that are going crazy here. Just do what you guys got to do. Be meticulous and patient and watch things start happening here, viewer, okay? It's, it's, it's already happening right now. Okay, so maybe for some of you guys, it's just time to get to work here, Ch you know, choosing your priorities, making healthy choices, doing whatever we got to do. Oh, some of you guys. Oh, oh, that's what. Okay. Clearing the air too. Okay. Great purification process. Some of you viewers, maybe it's time to uh, clean, simplify, uh, get rid of declutter, whatever it is, clean house, you know, get rid of stuff. Okay. Clear the energy. The old has to be released here because the new is entering, viewer. <laughs> get ready. It's like get ready, get prepped, get clean, clear out space, whatever you guys got to do. What else? And also, um, just stay consistent on the things that are working in your life, that are building up, okay? And everything else is going to be taken care of here. 
imagine yes you are see i'm telling you see i told you viewer it's already happening you're in you're between worlds right now viewer there's no doubt about it okay so start imagining or focusing on the positives or the good things we do have this yang and the uh the yin yang energy so it's like you can't have one without the other here so it is creating something so spirit is definitely working with you viewer oh my goodness Viewer, you're, a lot of you viewers are going to be gifted a beautiful lifestyle change. Okay, listen to me again. You're going to be gifted a beautiful lifestyle change. So go with it. Okay, use your mind wisely here. Okay, don't let your imagination, you know, give you things to imagine that you don't want to imagine. Take, take control, right? Clear that mind if you need to. Whatever you guys got to do. But focus on the things that you really want to happen in your life, okay? Or just uh, stay um, focused on the tasks at hand, right? But just spirit is opening you guys to possibilities here when it comes to a new world of yours. Okay, I'm just trying to figure out where to put these cards. Let's see. What else for the viewer? <laughs> okay i was talking about you know just get to work here we had chop the wood that's so funny i'm getting like eight of pentacles energy taurus virgo capricorn energy also water sign uh is coming through cancer pisces scorpio um yeah viewer financial issues are a factor in your love life right now some of you guys are figuring something out when it comes to your finances as, as well and i do feel that you are going through changes with your finances okay um Remember what I said, things are temporary, right? You're learning things, you're figuring things out. Um, I just feel like saying this for some of you viewers, well, maybe for whatever, who to take the, <laughs> I just feel like I need to. Your finances are really closely connected to your love life as well, viewer. When we're feeling restricted in our finances because maybe, and I'm not saying, it doesn't, I don't really, I do not care how much money or resources one has. It's what we're feeling on the inside. When we're feeling very restricted or constricted, we are not, we're not feeling full in life, okay? And it doesn't mean that money is important, but, you know, finances and career, they are, they, well, I'm not, I guess I should say, yes, they are important because, how we are treating money and the way that we feel about money is really linked with, um, you know, how we're feeling about ourselves and others. So like I said, when we're feeling constricted and restricted, then we're not able to give from a full heart, okay? Or there's another thing that's going on for some of you. It's the habits, right? Uh, creating healthy habits, healthy choices when it does come to our money. So I'm not saying all of you viewers are going through, you know, maybe like an uncomfortable state when it comes to having to figure things out with finances. But when you start creating and doing things on, you know, when it comes to healthy decisions and choices with your finances and with your work, everything else starts to really align. Everything else starts to just really come into place. It just falls into place. So viewer, you are doing something correct here. You are building something. You are establishing something. Some of you, if you're not feeling like you're working and establishing something, you're being shown the way to do this, okay? So be willing to stay flexible and adaptable. Be willing to um, go through a sense of being uncomfortable because a change in the wind will do that, especially when we're being guided to move away from things and especially from the past that could get us going around and around and around it again okay we don't, we're done with that but anyhow viewer your finances and your career is advancing or something that you guys are committed to is advancing and building up so spirit is saying just be meticulous be patient do your do what you guys got to do you know chop wood got to work right do whatever it is that you guys got to do and don't worry about anything else okay tend to your garden it will grow if there is an abundant harvest later um down the road here for you okay what else for the viewer 
a message in a bottle. Some type of news and information here um, is coming your way. So some of you may need to come to the edge though to really get these messages. I mean, we've got answers. We've got meditation brings answers here. Okay. Some type of, um, there's something at a distance here with this message in a bottle for you viewers. So spirit says, come to the edge here, right? You know, for some of you, um, I do get this thing for some of you viewers, you may be feeling, um, like you are being pushed out of your comfort zone. Okay. Just, you know, continue, continue to keep going forward, continue to, build your strength from the inner, uh, from, you know, from the inside out and also being really peaceful during it. Okay. Cause that takes a lot of strength as well, but expect some type of good news viewer. Okay. Expect some, some type of good news information. Let's see what else for the viewer. In the new future. <laughs> viewer look that serendipity look for a sign um i think i was saying that too that there's something better yeah in the near future viewer near future okay because literally you're in this like middle here where, where, where'd that where'd that go between worlds okay you're right here okay spirit is saying there's something better yeah there's something better especially when it comes to your love life connection or even your purpose all of it Okay, whatever works for you, there's something better here. Also, I'm getting a lot of you guys. Um, yeah, why not go out and extend your lighthearted energy to others? Do things, again, that give you guys energy. You know, get, you know, have fun because that can help you guys feel a sense of regeneration here. Okay. What else for the viewer? give your relationship a chance and let your friends help you. Yeah. Some of you viewers, um, you know, you're going to know, you're going to know if it's right for you or not. But, um, I was getting some of you guys having some, uh, um, a connection, re you know, come to recovery, like healing and mending. So that's definitely, um, in the cards here and spirit says, give your relationship a chance and work on your partnership. Okay. Let your friends help you ask for and accept support from others. But, um, for, <laughs> For you others out there, you need to give something a chance because I'm seeing this thing about you guys taking a risk, right? There's something better, okay? So it's like come to the edge and or wherever that card was. Yeah, come to the edge and take a risk here, okay? Um, and give it a chance. Give this relationship a chance here, okay? And some of you, you you know, ask your friends for help, and especially if you're feeling a little like, you know, at the beginning or, um, you know, or I would say is if you're feeling a little inexperienced or, you know, you just need, um, you know, you just need to have people listen to you, whatever it is, someone is getting a little makeover here too. So <laughs> there may be something here with you guys, um, you know, reinventing yourself as well, having a makeover. Um, let's see what else for the viewer. It's going to happen very soon. Viewer, my goodness. Okay. Remember we're talking about the yang, the yin yang energy. Something is being created. Spirit is definitely working with you. Mother, father, God is working with you, viewer. Okay. Very soon. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Mm. It's got to get clear, right? So this is, this is maybe go back to why meditate and ask why. So then you can get clear. Okay. Now, some of you. All you have to do is ask your angels. All you have to do is ask the universe and you will get the answers. It'll show up in some form, but you got to be, you got to be in that state of observation and aware for it to happen. Okay. So yeah, uh, clearly decide what you want. Cause it's going to happen real soon here, viewer. And I do see a lot of you viewers have been making good choices when it comes to building and establishing yourself and doing what you can that's right with your money and all that good stuff. Okay. So, um, it's happening viewer. It's happening for you. What else? Okay. These two cards just came out. Oh my gosh, that is funny. And I feel like 
Okay, someone is returning from your past. Separation time apart from your partner is on the horizon here. And it is worth waiting for. So viewer, there's someone that, you know, and I was getting that judgment card here. So for some of you guys, there could be someone from a past life, a past life soulmate here that's, um, that you guys have been separated from this lifetime and you're coming together. But also there's that potential of some of you guys having to really let go of that past um, with someone and whatever had happened. Okay, and give your relationship a chance, but it has to come at a clean slate. And I would say for a lot of you viewers, um, if you happen to have someone come from the past and you start observing that there is no pattern change, that's your cue that that's not, it's not it. There's something better. Okay. So yeah, you are meant to come into a connection. It's like you're literally in the middle here, okay? So you're between worlds. Spirit is saying it's worth waiting for. You guys have known each other before. Somehow you ha your souls have known each other before, okay? And yes, you've been separated from them. But you guys are seeing signs. What else? Yep. So um, when the opportunity strikes, or some of you guys, you might even have the opportunity right now, um, don't hold back. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. I mean, we have this card about flirting, you know, so yeah, spirit says those feelings are real. Don't hold back. Allow yourself that freedom to explore those feelings, okay? What else for the viewer? revealing illusion yeah i feel right now viewer just be lighthearted. some of you you may just need to laugh at a situation or at people here because i do feel for some of you viewers it's been revealed now for some of you something will be revealed when it comes to illusions in one's life or things that have been an illusion because of others okay so yeah don't be scared of things that are being revealed here because it's only helping you guys find your true north your true path Okay. It was almost like something it was almost like you guys kind of knew something was going to happen or it was just like for some of you you could even be hung up about it because maybe you felt like so foolish or um I don't know if it, you felt foolish but you felt fooled in some way or um, you know, you might be kicking yourself about it. Like, why didn't I, why didn't I just listen to myself? It's, oh, those whys. <laughs> so you got, some of you guys are up in your head, aren't you? Asking yourself, why did I do that? Why did I, like being obsessive about something in the past here? These ones aren't in the camera, are they? Let's move these over. So yeah, spirit is saying, just laugh, just laugh about the situation actually. Okay. Laugh at yourself <laughs> and, and don't take anything too seriously. Okay. Um, just seek the lesson because a lot of you guys are understanding. And this is the good thing actually too. When I, when I was saying seek the lesson, I was thinking too about this devil energy of this being a trap here. So it's like, you guys, with that round and around, remember cycles, patterns, you're, you're starting, you, you see these, viewer, you're seeing these. So it's like, just know that you guys are walking forward in a path where you can see these traps from a, a mile away, okay? So there's like really no getting over one on you. Okay, so seek the lesson for some of you guys. Um, this might be a time, you know, I'm looking at that, let your friends help you for some of you to connect with others or your friends here, uh, the ones that are positive. <laughs> okay, what else for the viewer? And some of you viewers need to hear this, and I know it can, it, it sounds not so good or it could be challenging, but I want you to focus on where you guys are headed here, okay? You're headed towards a new life here, a very blessed life, okay? Um, some of you viewers, you just got to listen. It's like, <clears throat> especially in connections and relationships, it's like you've got to wade or get, go through people to get to the right people. 
So sometimes, yes, we've got to go through certain relationships and connections to get to the right one, to experience what we need to experience so that we can really get to a place where we know is true and authentic for ourselves, and where we feel very comfortable and right at home with ourself and another, okay? So don't get hung up too much about, you know, things not working out in the past or why, 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 okay? Because now I'm getting the eight of swords for a lot of you viewers with that devil card and this why, asking too many whys here. Remember, we can go round and round with that story as well. It's your choice. So some of you, it's like, uh, do what you guys can do to maybe even distract yourself at this time, right? Just do things that help you improve your health, okay? Um, and get playful, because I was getting this thing about you guys being childlike. So re to recapture romance, just, you know, do things that are fun for you, right? I was getting this thing about maybe hanging out with friends or positive people. Allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. And if you can't, do things that you, you know, that make you feel young and alive, okay? And be playful. Because something did get you guys, and that's the... <laughs> Ugh, that's why I said this is about karma here, a balancing of karma. So something had to be uh, balanced out here. So to be fair, Spirit is gifting you guys exactly and what you need and who you need, okay? You're not going to be left... Um, you're not going to... Actually, I should say this. You're not going to be denied fulfillment, okay? What else for the viewer? Okay, that's it for those. So let's find out what does a viewer need to be aware of here? What does a viewer need to be aware of? See, viewer, there's a double card. <laughs> let, let go of control issues. <laughs> Yeah, allow this situation to unfold naturally. That's what you need to be aware of. See, I kept getting this saying, you guys are up in your head. Why, 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 why? Okay, spirit has to tell you guys, you have to stay flexible. You can't figure it all out. Let things be a surprise as well. Divine timing is at work in your love life because it is worth waiting for, okay? It is going to be worth it because it's going to make things karmically balanced here and fair, Um, let's find out how spirit is helping you, viewer. How is spirit helping the viewer? Spirit's helping you guys really trust the situation to really build your faith right now. Um, to let go of control issues. A spirit says, um, when it comes to your love life, viewer, we got it handled. We just need you to let go, okay? Don't uh, force anything. There's something about a lot of you viewers just kind of um, taking a step back, okay? And just trusting right now because spirit knows that the, the change, <laughs> a change in the wind has really caused a lot of you uh, to question things right now, okay? And I do feel for some of you viewers, you may have someone coming from the past here with that reconciliation and you may have, um, like you may have another person that's like, like I said, <laughs> it's a soulmate, okay? Your soulmate's good or bad, right? You could have a choice between two people, one from the past and one, somebody that's new, but that definitely could feel like an old soul here from the, um, you know, from a past life, um, so you could have the potential of being um, in a position of making a decision. Okay, so um, the more you stay strong with yourself and do things that regenerate you and make you feel powerful, the better and more aligned that you are going to be with making the right decision that's for you, okay? Um, Spirit wants to tr have you to trust yourself and have confidence in yourself as well, viewer. Okay, so... I want to get one more for how spirit's helping you too, viewer. Oh, this one just decided to fall out. How else is spirit helping the viewer? Yep, 
Yeah, situation is going to improve. Don't worry. You're in a temporary spot right now, viewer. This between worlds is a temporary situation here. And I was getting that earlier with that flexible card. So just remember to stay flexible. Maybe some of you guys are wanting to do some type of physical routine or yoga or stretching. So take care of your body, okay? Because then you'll feel... Um, a lot more strong too. <laughs> Look at this, being in the present moment, being in the moment fully right now so that you guys are res can be aware and, respons um, and respond when the time is right here to, you know, opportunities, actions, decisions. So attraction, you attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. So spirit is helping you guys feel more attractive, uh, feel more confident. Um, getting out of your head, maybe getting outdoors a little bit more, being out in nature and attracting a romantic love into your life. That's how spirit's helping you, viewer. Okay, the situation is going to improve. Just trust this and look for those signs. Okay, I hope that was helpful. Love and light. Take care.